what's up it's Kate and Angel and sorry for this awkward angle I'm going to do the room tour that I was gonna do that I kept forgetting to do so I'm starting outside my room and we're just gonna go in right now um so personally I pride myself on my room a lot because it's and it's very personally customized There's a lot of shit in here because I like to do stuff in my room a lot anyway um, so this is the first thing we walk in. Here's the door, uh, covered in some band posters that I have ripped out of magazines and stuff. We got a lot of Pierce the Veil, some Sleeping with Sirens, a little bit of other stuff. Um, so all of my walls are covered in art and such. Um, so this is some of my own artwork I've done. So some of them are, if you can notice, uh, copies of Ghost Town, Alistair Dipner's work, because I really admire his artwork. Um, so a lot of my art is based on him. So like that's my own piece, that one, that one, you know, and that one. Um, I made a lot more of it, but usually I end up giving it away to my friends and stuff. So that's my little art wall. That was the final project I did for my uh, Foundations of Art class. Um, this is what you used to me, my old door. Hi, it's me. <laughs> um, it was my door, and I was putting stickers on it, but we had to get new doors because these are like really so like hollow, like you can hear how hollow that is if you, like this one's solid so you can't hear anything through it. Anyway, it's got my mirror, it's got tons of stickers on it, I kind of collect them. Uh, I don't know, I think they're kind of cool. Like st some of these I got for free, some of them I got from Newberry Comics, some of them are just like from other stuff, I don't know, and then some of them I bought, you know. Hi. This one I got made. This is a vinyl sticker of the Satanic Cross. Um, some of this stuff just came from people though. Uh, but yeah. Oh, and then I got some of the stuff. Like restricted area, no soliciting, watch your step. Got that from CVS. I'm pretty sure they're supposed to be for businesses, but I was like, nah, that's going on my that's going on my fucking door. Oh, this is a little box. It's a shoe box. My I got my it's a demonia shoe box. Um, but I put tissue paper in it and my cat likes to sleep in it, so I keep it here. Um, oh, this is some other shit. This was for my mom's birthday this year. This is a Halloween decoration, um, but he's staying here. His name is Gruesome. This is a Pierceville water bottle my mom got for me, weirdly enough. Um, it's my laundry. Here's some more art. I didn't make that. That's a poster I got from a place called Newberry Comics. Uh, here's some watercolor paintings I've done before. They're kind of hidden. A yoga mat, my, you know, uh, it's a humidifier. I'm six, so I've been using that. Um, some more, like, abstract art, surrealist piece. And this is a little bit of collection that I've done. So this is just a nice little setup I have. I have candles for my satanic Bible. These are for rituals that I've been doing lately, but, like, you know. Um, this is mostly just stuff for, like, rituals and shit. Yoga cards, because I do yoga. This is a ceiling tile from my school, actually. It's a funny story. My friend was like pissed off by the ceiling tile that was like leaning out of the ceiling. Like it wasn't flat, it was just like horizontal. I mean, wait, no, vertical. So he lifted me up on his shoulders and I tried to push it back in, but instead it kind of fell out, so I just took it home. This is a wall plaque from um, my school. I found it on the floor, I didn't rip it off, so now it's on my wall. This is the painting my friends found on the side of the road. Um, here's some more of my artwork. This is stuff I did in my painting class. All of this. This is my couch. That I got from, uh, I saw Frank Iero and the Patients and the Homeless Gospel Choir together. Uh, that's some merch from the Homeless Gospel Choir, so I put it on my the back of my thing. It's my backpack. Um, this is where I keep my vest. Also, this is my bed. So I keep my vest because I wear this every day. Um, those are all of my big shoes. These are like my regular shoes. That's my guitar that I never play. Um, here's some more art stuff. Here's like a random notebook, art journal, a book, my amp, my air conditioner. Oh, my pride flag that my friend Sawyer gave me. And this is um, a hijab that my friend Naima painted on and she didn't want it, so I kept it. Uh, these are some Marilyn Manson quotes because I'm edgy as fuck that are on my wall. Um, oh, here's some more. These are both some posters I did for some protests. The first one I made for the Women's March back in 2016, 17, I don't remember when it was. Um, it was a Black Lives Matter one, and then there's another one I did for March for Our Lives. 
um, which actually the mayor of my city read that one out loud and he really liked it. Those are my oil paintings that I've done. They kind of suck, but you know. My parents found this in Harvard Square and I took it home. Well, they took it home for me, so I put it on my door, my belts, uh, my shoes. This is where I keep all of my gloves, my hats, like my fancy socks, stuff like that. Uh, this is where I keep all of my you know, necklaces and like leashes and shit like that. That's my skateboard, that's a blanket, some random bags. This is just some random shit that's in my room, like a bunch of no, notebooks and painting books or whatever, paper or whatever. So I have all of the Daria episodes on DVD because that shit's fucking great. Just, you know, random stuff. My shoes. Um, this is a picture that someone who used to be my friend took of me and they made the frame for me. This is where I keep my money. I also used to keep my cigarettes in here, so it smells like cigarettes. This is stuff my niece gives me, my sister gave me that. I found that in the trash, so I took it. So this is my, like, photo wall. So, um, I didn't take any of these, obviously. One of the photography teachers at my school stopped me in the hallway, and he's like, hey, I like your style. Come to my class during fourth period, and I'm gonna have one of my students take pictures of you. So this is one of the pictures, and now he has some of those pictures on his door, which is really cool. Um, my friend Ruby took this picture of me. And then the thing with the photography photography teacher happened to, again, so this is another picture from another set. I ended up in the Boston Globe newspaper for the March for Our Lives. Picture of my niece. These are some pictures my friend Tamora took of me. This is one with my cat. Look at her. Okay, and this is one of my friend Ginevra. And then here are some more of me. And this is my desk. Uh, this is, that's my box of like memories is what I call it. It's a bunch of shit from my childhood in there. So I just keep it under my desk. Oh, this is a box of shredded paper I found on the side of the road and I took home. Um, this box is full of other shit that I found around my school and outside and stuff, so. Jewelry stuff, I keep all of my old plugs. Someone used to be my friend Danny, wrote a bunch of letters to me over the summer. This is my bag of concert memories and shit. This is my bag of concert memories and shit. Uh, I have my signed ID from Frank Aero in here. Oh, what else we got? Oh, this is my, um, shelf of shit. This is all eyeliner. Some more makeup shit. I got this contouring kit so I can contour my face so it looks more masculine. My fangs, all of my hair dye stuff, um, all of my oils. I've got jojoba oil, vitamin E oil, what the hell is this? Argan oil, tea tree oil, lotion, all that shit. Uh, hair dryer, blow dryer. Some random shit I found on the side of the road. Found that skateboard outside and I took it home. Actually, on Pride last year, every green tea bag I've ever used I got this from Trans Remembrance Day. Well, I drink a lot of Coke Zero, and we got a big pack of it, and this one was just fucking empty, and there's a hole in it, so, you know, I, this just came with it, so I decided to keep it. This is, uh, these were my prom flowers that my ex-friend Caroline gave me. This is just a ramen. Uh, this is from a fence, I'm pretty sure. Some rusty metal I found on the roof, some rusty metal I found next to a library. A shell I found in the hallway at my school. A bike lock, a broken bike lock that I found. Hi, it's me. Hi, all of my mirrors are dirty. Um, oh, some more posters. Some Pierce the Veil, Pierce the Veil poster, uh, Fall Rivers poster. Some little signs I've made, something my friend made for me. My friend Lily, she's the best. That, someone's running for student body president at my school and he made himself into Mr. Incredible and I think that's fucking hilarious. So I just ripped it off the wall and took it home. This is where all my paint is. This is, this, I didn't make this. It's just a used canvas that my art teacher gave me. My paintbrushes, my paper, a box that I keep my charger on so I can charge my phone when I'm on my bed. Oh, that's also my, my jar of wristbands. Those, that's KT tape, which I use for binding. This is for the water, some markers and shit. This is a box full of random stuff, uh, like sewing needles and chains and stuff that I use to like customize my clothes or whatever. I don't know why there's an egg carton in here. Um, some more drawing pencils, my headphones that I found in the hallway. I found these in the fucking hallway at my school, so I took them home. I think that's it. I, I could go into way more detail, but this is already a long video, so I'm not going to. Hi again. Um, oh, my closet. Hi, welcome to my closet. I used to live here. I <laughs> get it. Fucking gay jokes. Um, my clothes, I guess. I hang some of my clothes up, I suppose. And then there's some random shit in there. Uh, <coughs> I'm 
coughing again, yay. These are <coughs> all of my clothes. Can you guess my favorite color? These are all my band shirts. And then all of my jeans, they're all black, except for those checkered ones. Uh, fucking underwear and shit. Uh, pajamas, one pair of sweatpants I own that I, that don't fit me. My other roommate from my CBAT gave them to me, so they're kind of more memorial. Um, she's also a lot bigger than me, so I didn't fit them. Uh, oh, I'll show you my bed. I actually made my bed for once. Welcome to my bed. That's Charlie. Um, I got him from Walgreens. I love him. This is my bed. It's very comfortable. Many pillows. There, that's the quilt. Everything's black, so when my phone's up here, I can never find it because my phone case is black. Everything I own is black. It's hard to find anything ever. I think that's everything. All right, yeah, that's pretty much my room. Uh, hi, it's me again. I'm not gonna turn it sideways, actually. So I hope you enjoyed looking at my room, I guess. I don't know. I thought it'd be interesting because I really like my room and I like to show it off to people all the time because I can't believe you can see me. I show it off to people all the time though. So it's like, hey, look at my room. I'm proud of myself. I clean my room sometimes. Fuck yeah, it's organized and shit too. So like, whip. Anyway, <coughs> don't mind me, I'm sick. Um, anyway, I guess that's it for the video. But thank you for watching, I suppose. I don't know why you'd watch this personally. But, you know, I try and make things interesting. Sometimes I succeed. Haha. <laughs> Alright, anyway, adios. Thanks for watching, my dudes.